One, two, one, two, three, four. Anyone that's learned to speak the language of jazz knows what the shed is all about. And they've all had to make decisions about the best way to spend their time in that shed. What to work on, how long to work on it, and how it relates to the music. The new Bebop Shed Pack is a collection of 10 Bebop insights that will help you develop jazz vocabulary with my special language system. Each insight is accompanied by a mini video lesson and the 10 jazz standard tune references featured in the Jazz Everyone Tunes to Know and Blow series. These mini lessons will be helpful if you're not working online uh, with my online system. So let's get started. In Bebop Insight number one, I'm going to show you how to make jazz music with sets of simple two-note melodies that I call pentatonic pairs. These pentatonic pairs are the genesis of my jazz language system. Here's the way the pentatonic pairs are created for a 2-5-1 chord progression. At the top of your study guide number one download, <clears throat> you'll see an extended major scale numbered with brackets under the 2nd, 3rd, 5th, 6th, 1st, 2nd scale steps. This is actually a major pentatonic scale if you start on the 1st scale step and play 1, 2, 3, 5, 6. As you play, you will hear how the pentatonic pairs lead your melodies through the descending tonal centers of these 2, 5, 1 chord changes. Now's the time to head for the shed with a little routine. First, let's check out the sound of these pentatonic pairs with the chord changes on the play tracks like this. Now I'm just going to play through these very simply with the notes, okay? One, two, one, two, three, four. <laughs> in all the keys to help you imitate what I play in the four bar phrases through the 251 progressions in all keys. Okay, let's give it a shot. One, two, one, two, three, four. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha 
Okay. Uh, now it's time for you to make up some melodies of your own with these uh, pentatonic pairs through the 251 chord changes. Just remember that time is essential. Keeping playing with that beat. Hello. Also, I would suggest that you might try transcribing some of these uh, patterns if you have trouble playing them. All right. Uh, when you're comfortable with the pentatonic pairs and all the keys, you're ready to work with the pentatonic pairs through the ten tunes and the no and blow reference. When the pentatonic pairs are in your ear and under your fingers and you've gone through all ten of these pattern or tunes and you can play them pretty well, uh, hey, go on to uh, insight number two. We'll add the major third, which I did in one of or two of those patterns. Sorry. One, two, one, two, three, four.